They used to teach us that as the teacher, our last word is the word thanks. Thanks is a great last word, so it goes like this. Ready? I believe I saw you drop that piece of paper, and I would appreciate it if you picked it up. Thanks, gone. As I'm walking away, what will certain kids do under their breath as you're walking away? What will they do? Yeah, they do the little mumble grumble about you under the breath. You know what the mumble grumble is? Just say, knock it off, cut it out, please be quiet. You start walking away, and as you're walking away, don't certain kids do something like this under their breath? Whatever, Mr. Menley. Anyway, you skinny, bald, high pants, you don't even know. I'll call my cousin, and he'll punch you. And then I'll get my uncle, because you're just ugly, dumb, skinny, blah, 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 blah. Don't be the one who says, knock it off, cut it out, please be quiet, turns and walks away, kid mumbles, we get to hear, and we actually stop, and we turn, and we ask the single dumbest question ever invented in the history of education. What did you say to me, young man? Or what did you say to me, young lady? Because you already know what they said. And the last thing you want them to do is repeat it. But what's that theme today? Remember, we've had that theme all day. It's been a good one. That theme, if I change me, I change everything around me. Imagine, just imagine for fun, just for fun. Imagine that this happens, ready? Imagine that you say, knock it off or cut it out or please be quiet, and you start walking away. And as you're walking away, imagine the kid mumbles this under their breath, ready? Imagine they mumble this. <clears throat> Excuse me, Mr. Mendler. But right now, I have to call you a couple names under my breath. Because if I don't, I'm going to look like a wimp in front of the entire class. And I can't look like a wimp in front of the entire class. Everyone knows that. So could you please be the mature adult with a college degree and continue walking away from me right now? Because I got to eat lunch with these guys, and I got to ride the bus with them, and I got to be on the playground with them, and I got to play sports with them. I, after all, Mr. Mendler, what do you tell us to do? When someone calls us a name on the playground, you tell us to just turn and? Well, how come you can't? After all, Mr. Mendler, what do you tell us to do? When someone says something else that we don't like in the locker room, you tell us to just ig. Well, how come you can't? And if you did, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you very much, sir. If a kid mumbled that, how many are you going marching back? And I'll argue, and I think I'll win, that that's exactly what they're saying in the only way they can say it. They can't say it any other way.